Linda and I have been friends, personal friends, since the 70s. We met in 1971 at a black nurses meeting, and we have been friends ever since. We just seem to have hit it off, and we've sustained that friendship from that day. I was the president of the National Black Nurses before she she uh, became the president. We've worked together on the board of the National Black Nurses. We've done research together. We've done health literacy. We developed together the National Black Nurses community um, collaboration model that's used in community work throughout the country. And Linda always says, anything you want to do, Alicia, don't let anybody dissuade you. You can do it. And that's the way she's been, not just with me, but with members of my family and with all her friends and, and with her staff. Linda has worked her way up to being one of the top nurse executives in this country, and I may venture to say internationally. What she has done to promote nursing is she, within her own institution, has nurtured and promoted nurses to positions of influence, Linda has been involved in community and not just in the city of Los Angeles, but in her tenure as president of the National Black Nurses in communities across the country. Linda coming in as the co-chairperson of the Future of Nursing uh, Committee at the National Academy of Medicine really let those who did not know her know what she has done in advancing nursing in this country because what Linda talks about is human caring, and she thinks that's where nurses are the experts in human caring. One of the things that Linda has done, and she, she tried to not let anybody know, she finds these young people who may be having some financial hardships, and Linda makes sure that they get enough money to pay for their tuition, and that's the kind of thing she does. She, she makes sure that the human caring permeates her entire institution under her leadership. Linda is a phenomenal woman and deserves every award. And this is one that I know she will be so greatly honored to receive.